English. Yeah, I like English. It's like a, a, a grammar, you know. But then people ask him, I don't know when I would say we are a date. Hi everyone, my name is Zinke Gidi, known on Facebook as Uboti Shomuga. This is Books and Paper, where we'll be reviewing our African authors, uh, our African books by our African authors. I, uh, I review books on Facebook, that is what I'm known for. I review books uh, since the beginning of, I think, two to three years now, but I after joining the challenge of 2019 through Goodreads, this is when I started being like following each book that I was reading. I joined a challenge of reading 52 books, which is 52 books, uh, 52 books per week. We will be reviewing our African literature, books that are written by our own local writers from South Africa. Uh, today we will be reviewing five books that are written by our authors. The first one would be Yesterday I Cry by Smu Ngubane. And the second one will be Her Broken Pieces by Minenke Kumalo. The third one will be the real price of degree, of a degree by Tutugani Ngosi. The last one, no, the fourth one will be The Why in Your Man is Silent by Yvonne Makosa. And the last one is one of our celebrities, which is Ibex and Dibbles by Bonnie Hena. So those are the books that we'll be reviewing today. Kubani, uh, on the Yesterday I Cry, this is the first book, I think it's one of the first books that I, I read this year um, when I started the challenge that uh, I'm, read, I'm supposed to read in fact 52 books that I've already done. So it's one of the books that I read, I think it was the second or third book. So more on this book uh, talks about the challenges that we face as, as people. Okay, it is a, a spiritual book that will make you to regain your self-confidence because when, when, when we, we when we when problems comes into our lives we we lose our self confidence we lose self self esteem we think that we do not exist we, we think that we do not we do not have what other people have people run away from you when you are going through problems they leave you and your family also it's not there so this book gives hope it's a book that gives you hope uh, that says there is nothing that that is more is more than uh, what God has planned for us. What is important, I think what I took away from this book is the fact that once you find your own purpose, uh, things happen. Uh, you, will, you, will, you will grow as a person. You just need to know what is it that God, you have to listen to the Spirit, what God wants from you, and then act on that thing. This is all about our first book, which is Is It That I Cried by Sbun Mubane. Uh, uh, this book is got 139 pages. It is not a big uh, book, but what is important here, the knowledge that you get from this book, it is valuable. It is more than some big books that you can have. So it's something that you can take away with, take it home, um, read, and you, you'll grow. In fact, it's something that you can read each and every day to revive yourself. Okay, that's all from the book. Yesterday I cried by Sbun reviewed by Uboti Shomuga for books and papers.